you have finished your plan now you have tagged your walls you have tagged your windows you have tagged your doors and you want to show that information to the contractor and naturally you go to legend views new legend view let's say scale 1 to 20 and add some components let's start with the windows i'll switch to front view elevation okay great let's put some dimensions here and there okay great now let's match that window to the window i have in plan okay now let's copy that and let's match that to the other window i have in my plan okay cool okay now let's align them okay great and now let's add window tags hmm it seems like tag by category doesn't work you have to tag your windows manually and in reality the only way you can tag your windows in legend views is to write them in text notes and you have to do that for every window and if the type mark changes you have to rewrite it manually and if you want to make it look like a window tag you have to draw a detail lines around it and it's ridiculous but there is a smart workaround that you can use to make your legends truly adaptive so you don't have to draw your window tags by hand and to do that you have to use phases click on phases and click insert before existing phase and call that phase legends now duplicate existing view and rename it level one legends this is the view where your legends are going to be placed next draw a wall similar to the wall that you have your windows in and create similar put some windows on that wall now place elevation in front of that wall and change the phase to the elevation to the legends and see how it disappears now change phase created to legends and phase demolished to existing now go to that elevation you can see your windows and your wall there rename it to the window legends and you can hide your wall it's only needed as a host for the windows it's a good idea to stretch the wall to the right so you can copy the windows to the right afterwards and here you go you can tag your windows look at that let's place some dimensions and the height okay great now let's go to the level one legends and change the face for the view to legends and here we can see our windows and our wall let's create two doors here let's say that one and here another one i'm gonna check that this door is the right door okay great now let's go to our elevation view and here are our doors let's move them to the right let's tag them realign the tags remove the leaders we don't need that let's put some dimensions for the doors also let's put one right here okay change the scale let's arrange them and let's see that they correspond to the plan and this doesn't match the legend so we probably need to change the tag we have to edit the tag and we have to change the mark to type mark after that let's reload the tag and that will probably fix the correspondence issue error okay great now we are all set we can change the type marks to d2 and d1 okay and here you can see that this door doesn't match the plan and this automation feature of door tags really helps to catch mistakes so what else can we do if we want to add a file writing for these doors we can easily do that let's say one hour and then we have to edit this door tag we have to edit this family and then let's duplicate this label so that we can assign fire rating parameter to that label and then we have to add uh, visibility parameters to those labels let's say this one is fire under graphics and the type mark let's edit that and add new visibility parameter and call it type mark under graphics okay okay and load into the project overwrite okay great and now we have to just duplicate these door tags and switch on the correct visibility parameters for each one of them and when we do that we can tag the fire rating for each of the doors okay great let's change that to fire one hour great and let's tag this one so that our contractors knows which doors have which fire ratings let's say one hour to these doors also and next thing we can do we can rename the elevation view to windows and doors legends and we can duplicate the elevation as dependent and rename this to let's say windows duplicate again as dependent and rename that to doors then we all we have to do is stretch the crop boundary and put them on the sheet and you are golden 
and if you want to add a plan view for the windows and doors you can duplicate the floor plans legend view as dependent crop that and put that uh, next to these elevations so i really hope the delta disk someday adds these functions to the legends so we don't have to draw manually these door tags and window tags and until that i hope this helps have a great day and see you in the next video